County health officials are raising concerns about an increase in COVID-19 cases. We told you earlier this week, 41 out of the 100 North Carolina counties are now in that high risk category. WBTV's Liliana Pearson live this morning. Liliana, Met County remains in the medium risk right now. Mary, we do sit in that medium risk right now, but the county health director is telling us that if these trends continue, Mecklenburg County could soon move into the high risk category. And across the state right now, 50% of cases are being attributed to the BA5 variant of Omicron, which is more contagious. The county seeing an increase in cases, deaths, hospitalizations and increases in wastewater monitoring for the virus. Those are all early warning indicators. Uh, as noted in our release last week, um, we are concerned uh, and we want to make sure that folks in our community are aware of these increasing trends uh, and everyone take precautions and take advantage of the resources that we do have available uh, to reduce the impact of COVID on our community. And right now, 68% of people do have at least one vaccine. But Dr. Washington says, of course, as you're going out into the community, make sure you're weighing your risks, have that mask candy, and also make sure you're staying home if you're feeling sick. I'm Liliana Pearson, WBTV, on your side.